stay. That'll do kill me, sweet Demetrius. I charge thee hence, and do not haunt me thus. Oh, wilt thou, darkling, leave me? Do not so. Stay on thy trail. I alone will go. Oh, I am out of breath in this pond chase. The more my prey, the least is my grace. The happy her happiest Hermia, where so I should eyes, for she hath blessed and attractive eyes. How can her eyes so bright, not with salt tears? If so, my eyes are oftener washed than hers. No, no, I am ugly as a bad. For beasts that meet me run away for fear. Therefore, no marvel, dear Demetrius. Do as a monster, fly my presence does. With wicked and dissembling glass of mine, may me compare with Hermia's spidery, spidery eye. But who is here? Lysander on the ground, dead or asleep. I see no blood, no wound. Lysander, if you would, good sir, awake. And run through fire, I will, I will for thy sweet sake. Transparent Helena, nature show art, that through thy bosom makes me see thy heart. Where is Demetrius? Oh, how fit a word. Is that vile name to perish on my sword? Do not say so, I say not so. What thought he, what though he love your Hermia? Lord, what though? Yet Hermia so loves you, then be content. Content with Hermia? No, I do repent. The tedious minutes I with her have spent. Not Hermia, but Helena I love, who will not change a raven for a dove. The will of a man is by his reason swayed. And reason say, you are the worthier maid. Things growing are not right until their season. So I, being young, tone not right not to reason. And touching now the point of human skill, reasons become the marshals to my will, and leads me to your eyes where I overlook. Love stories written and love's richest books. Wherefore was I to this keen mockery born? When your hands did I deserve such scorn? It's not enough, it's not enough, young man. That did never, no, nor never can deserve us to look from Demetrius's eye. But you must flout my insufficiency? Good troth, you do me wrong, good sooth you do. In such disdainful manner me to woo. But fare you well, for force I must confess. I thought you lord of more true gentleness. Oh, that a lady of one man refused, should of another therefore be abused. She sees not Hermia, Hermia sleeps thou there. And never mayst thou, thou come, Lysander. For as surfeit of the sweetest things, the deepest loathing to the stomach brings, or as the heresies that men, stu men do weave, are hated most of those they did deceive. So thou, my surfeit and my heresy, of all hated but the most of me, and all my powers address your love and might to honor Helen and, and to be her knight. Help me, Lysander, help me. Do thy best to pluck this crawling serpent from my breast. I pity for me. Uh, what a dream was here, Lysander. Look how I do quake with fear. Me, though a serpent ear eats my e her heart away, and you sat smiling at this cruel play. Lysander, what removed? Lysander, Lord, what out of hearing gone? No sound, no word. Alack, where are you? Speak if you hear. Speak of all loves, a swoon almost with fear. No, then I will perceive you with no, with not nigh, neither death. Oh, you, I'll find immediately. 